Hi, Mark Savage here and welcome to my channel. Today's chat is about winter bikes. These are winter hacks. As you know, I've got a nice Ducati Multistrada. I don't want to put that through the winter. The last couple of years, as you know, I ride all year round. And I rode my Tiger and the Versus before that. And the new road salt they put here in the UK is like a black road salt. So corrosive on any parts. Yes, use ACF 50, but you know what? It still manages its way through that onto the bolts, onto the wheels, just really mucked up the bike. So I'm after a cheap winter hack, couple of grand's worth, and my top three for me, BMW's RT. And I'm on about a heavy duty tourer that I want to use as a winter hack. Heavy on the road, bit of luggage, protection, heated grips. I don't want to feel the wind and rain and freezing cold. So my first one is a BMW RT, 1100. You can pick them up reasonably cheap for under a couple of grand, but they are going to have some miles on them, 40, 50,000 miles. Triumph Trophy. I had a 1215 62 plate. I'm about the early ones. They're still good little motors. Again, high mileage. It was one local to me. 60,000 miles. I mean, that's just really to me at the end of its time. Honda ST1100. Again, massive mile munchers. I've had the newer 1300. I'm about an ST1100. They're still great bikes. Aging a little bit. I mean, when you come down to looking at the years I'm talking about, you're probably talking about an RT, about 02, and the rest of them about the same sort of years. They're my three top ones. Now, if you watch my channel, next video up and coming will be what I've got in my hands now. <laughs> so it's not for this video, but quick look at this one before I carry on with my bikes. Now, this little bike came to me from a guy who'd actually watched a few of my videos. He's changed the head already, but it needs a few more loving bits. This is a simple few little extras. There's a throttle grip, and here's an original one I made earlier. Or I can change a complete pack. One mirror, I could change them for two new ones. Well, second hand. The rear spoiler's loose, and it looks like it's been bent a little bit, although someone sprayed it up, but still, we can sort this out. Front shock seems seized, it says it's rusty, but to be honest with you, the front doesn't move, the back's a little bit spongy, so I could change both of them. Kickstart says it doesn't work, but I've got the outside of the kickstart. It mentioned the cog inside, so I weren't sure it's about the Bendix, I've got two. The actual kickstart lever. Or the kickstart bit that goes in the middle bit that actually spins it round. This goes into the variant and actually kicks it, so I've got all the bits needed there. All four lenses have been sprayed over black. I'm not quite sure, but he was spraying. I've got a couple of clear lenses at the back. I mean, petrol should get them nice and shiny again. In the seat bucket, it's missing a little bit that goes over the actual head. Here's one earlier. Now, it starts instantly, but it won't rev up that well. So I'm assuming it won't go top end. It may need the original part of the carburetor. It may need tuning. I'm going to take it all apart anyway. The rear tyre is really low. I've got another one. I might change them both. Even the centre cap. And the whole back light's held on with tape and it just looks a bit fiddled with. I've got another one, although it's got a little crack in it, still better than what's on there. Now the wife says to me, yeah, throw your parts away, clean your shed up. And I tell the wife, she's behind me, isn't she? Ow. This is why I say to the wife, I don't throw things away. I keep them, so I'm right. I mean, she was right and I should have thrown away in the first place but she really does make good cups of tea. No slap. So let's get back to what my video is about. This one's coming up after. Next bike, after my main three that I'm after. And there's a few, isn't there? You've got the old Kawasaki GTR 1000, had a 1400, big, heavy, busted girls. All I can describe them like. GTR's looking dated, if I'm honest with you. Now you've got other BMWs, you've got a GS 1100, 1150, you've got an RL is it, a huge sort of radioed one, don't mind the radio you know. The Yamaha Phaser, 600, 1000cc, I don't like the really early one, 01 plate, when it gets to 02 and it get the wider lights, I don't mind that. And it'd be nice to got a back box, that's what I really want to be able to do, take my uniform in, sandwiches, whatever I've got. As you know I don't want to put a back box on the back of the Ducati, so I'm not going to do that. Do I go back to a Versus 650? You know, 2,000 pound, I can get a reasonably newer one, M09 plate, very light bikes. I just don't know if I want to go back to one of them again. Honda VFR, uh, had an 800, I've had a 1200. For the money I'm after, I'll be honest with you, I'm gonna get a high mileage one that doesn't look all that. And of course, Honda CBF. You pick up them really, really, really cheaply. An 09 plate with a back box, that'll do. Or do I go for a damaged one, like a Cat D, which is now a Cat N. You're going to pick up a bargain there, but very hard to sell. 
I don't really mind if it's got cosmetic damage. Fall off it, I ain't gonna worry about it, which I don't intend to do. I even looked at the BMW G310. A very light little bike. I mean, they're five grand new. You can pick one up for two, two and a half grand. Maybe worth looking at. But again, no luggage, no sticker back box on the back. Or even do I go for a maxi scooter? You know, I've had the Bergman before, 400, 650. You've got the Honda Silver Wings, etc. Um, Gilera ones, 500, NX, I think they are. So there's lots to choose from. I think I'm going to go for the first three. If you've got any suggestions, please put your comments below and I'll do a review of it when I get it. I mean, it's still sunny here, early September. I'm still going to ride a Ducati right up until they start using the horrible stuff on the road. Meanwhile, I'm going to quite enjoy it. As I said, next video coming up will be this little thing here. We're going to go right the way through it. I'm going to take all the panels off and go from scratch. And I said this in all my videos about these little bikes. Take everything off. I know the guy said he's done this and he's done that, but for me, take it all off, strip it all down, then you know you've done everything. More often than not, there's one major thing that's wrong. But you can get five little things that contribute to all to one big thing not working. So it could be the carburetor's not tuned, the HT cap's not on properly, the plug's really dirty, the stator coil needs clean. So you might as well do all these things, then you know you've done them all. And that's how I fix speed fights. Mopeds. Moped. <laughs> I've got to say it before we finish now. Moped in the UK. I know what a moped was years ago with the pedals. I understand that. You haven't got to preach to me about that. It bugs the hell out of me. Scooters, mopeds. Here in the UK, same bloody thing, okay? Scooters to me, it's Vespers and Lamberettas. When you come to mopeds, it's on the logbook. It's on the side of the bike as well. Mopeds, moped. Please don't message me telling me that these are scooters and you're wrong, you're thick. Thousands of them, and I can show you on the logbooks. They're called mopeds here in England. Scooters, they're almost handles, and you push your foot on them. They're electric, and they're great in France. That's what we call scooters now, or as the old-style Lambrettas and Vespers. But all these little things, annoying things that zoom by, you're going, yeah, they're called mopeds. I just wanted to clarify that. I know about the pedals. Moving on. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Don't subscribe when I do this one. If you're not interested in mopeds, skip it. If you just want to see how I can make this look pretty, I've even got lots of decals that I'm going to put on this one as well. I can't decide whether I'm going to spray it black, leave it as it is, I don't know yet. Just have to wait and see on my next video. So, for a bit of fun, you can watch this old one, blue. These help turn out to be looking quite nice and back on the road again. There you go, finished. Hope you liked my editing. Pretty amazing, isn't it? I say T. And it just appears. Truly magic. And I just say wife, and she just appears. That's magic. Then I say don't slap me. Still got to work on that one. <laughs> Take care of yourselves. <laughs> Bloody woman. Did you see what I did? Can't see now what you're doing. So I don't need to see. Bubble Come away for a minute. You're gonna get the glare of the sun as well. See, when you do that, there's no sun. You should have done it the other way around. You need that wipe over here. I'll do it that way. Perfect. Pull up. Shed that. Well, it's just towards the sun's this side, isn't it? Yeah, there you go, it's better. Go for it. It's actually even worse, but it's not. It is, it's shining straight across, look. Look at that, see all the lines? Now take your hand can away. You can you do that? Well, I can do that. I'll tell you what, what you do. That. Perfect. Oh, oh. Right. Yeah, but Stand what if I move it in it, look, it's in it now. How's I'm that? Not so my arms would be knackered. It's come across good still, innit? That's perfect. It's the window's more worried about. The last couple of years now, as you know, I ride all year round. I drove a Triumph Trophy, the early ones. Had a big 1250, didn't I? 12. I've had the newer 1200. Stand back a bit, I won't be in the way. It doesn't even look like it's there. It looks like it's standing in the corner. 
and I mean it needs simple things like the throttle is it grip yeah. this is a simple few little extras there's a throttle grip and oh, it's Or I can change a complete pack. Next. I just want to move this thing. <laughs> one mirror. One mirror. I have to change them for two new ones. Well, second hand. That's your big part now. Now the wife says to me, yeah, throw your parts away, clean your shed up. Get behind me now, take the gloves off if you want to. Right behind me. You just appear at the side, so what I want you to do is just appear when I say, when I say something. And I think I should say, you know, and then you just put around and go, yeah. So come behind me. This is what I tell the wife, not to throw away my mice. This is why I say to the wife, I don't throw things away. I keep them, so I'm right. Pop out again. I mean, she was right and I should have thrown away in the first place. Mm -hmm. You can go. Come round, give me the tea. Pants. Sorry? Zuki GSS. Fucking hell, sorry. Fuck, wank. I've been winners. Yamaha phasers. I don't like the early small light, light ones. Yamaha's phaser. <laughs> Fuck wank. I for something like a cat N or cat D, you know, the bait. Please don't email me. Please verify that. I know about the pedals. Moving on. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Be amazing, isn't it? I say T. And it just appears. Truly magic. Do you want to come in and slap me again? No, you should say, I say wife, and she truly appears. And I just say wife. 